Let's talk about um, the fact that Dubai is in a location in the world where with two hours flight or four hours flight from Dubai, we have more than a billion people that a part of that, uh, well, a p only a small part of them, but a percentage of a billion people is a big number. And, and so imagine and, and, that... And let me add something to the billion people. Billion people who are in, not necessarily all in world, first world countries, who are in emerging markets, in markets that are sometimes vierge. Yeah. Vierge, virgin. Ah, yes. And in markets that do not easily connect to other markets. So if you are an African, you want to do business with Europe, yeah. uh, historically, you did some of that business through Dubai. Yeah. You came and bought your cars from Dubai and traded them. Why? Because also you're welcome and you're respected. And at the same time, there is law and order. So you wouldn't be in general ripped off. There's always situations here and there that happens that are individuals. Yeah. yeah. But in general, you are respected and you can trust how business happens in the city. Yeah. And you know, I have uh, uh, almost 14 years uh, experience in, in uh, Dubai. I don't know you, you probably more. Slightly more. More, okay. And I did my own statistic. Uh, I have a statistic that Italians, because you know, I deal with uh, Italian people a lot, mostly. And Italian, when they come to Dubai uh, on holiday, or they come to Dubai to approach business or real estate investment, I have a statistic, 90 or maybe more than 90% of the people that they come to Dubai for the first time, they love it. They want to come back again and they are dreaming to love in Dubai, to, sorry, to live in Dubai. They love to live, live and in love Dubai. Dubai. Live Why and not? Love, yes. They fall in love with this, uh, a lifestyle with this city with this kind of uh, uh, new uh, solution is a life solution you know because I used to have a kind of uh, list of reason why the people love Dubai first is a business hub you can do your business nobody is bothering you there's no people who is asking the money and yeah. uh, and then is a safe place for you and your family then tax wise what's the, you know uh, if you tell Italians that in Dubai there's no tax on income they don't believe it they ask me but you don't pay it but you have yeah. to pay but you don't no no no, no. there's, there's no, no tax. tax on income that's why Dubai has a very large 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 potential and I believe that the potential of Dubai is not expressed yet Yep. What do you think? I do agree. There are a lot of mis, uh, misleading information about alcohol, for example. Uh, for ex some Italians, they ask me, is it true that in Dubai you cannot drink alcohol? I said, no, man. In Dubai, you can have your beer, you can have your, your glass of wine, wherever you want. Or drink a tea. Or drink a tea, yeah. Depending Dubai, in my opinion, is similar to a piece of art that has not been finished yet. Yeah. Yeah? It's in the process. But while we are doing that, while we're building it, by the way, this is by our friend Wael Hamadi. Okay. Visit his, uh, his uh, website, guys. Uh, Wael Hamadi. Uh, um, interesting uh, pieces of art, an interesting style. Let's say this city is Dubai. It's not finished yet. Uh -huh. And while he's drawing it and going forward with it, actually, we have one outside the city and the, the projects and the cranes. Mm -hmm. I'm sure you've seen yes, it. Yes, yes, I saw Beautiful it. one. This is what Dubai is. Let's talk about 20 years ago. We were talking also, I kind of cut you here to get you back to the old idea. Let's go back to the new idea Which of idea? the, the uh, great weather. People love the weather. Yeah. Because yeah. when in Europe it's cold, here yeah. it's pleasant and sunny. Okay. So that's also very interesting. That's also very interesting. And to top it up with 20 years ago, there was beautiful beaches and good weather, sun. There was little more 
that Dubai offers at that time? Yes. Hospitality? Yes. Uh, ability to trade freely? Yes. However, with time, we've evolved. One of the best infrastructures in the world. Yeah. Luxury like no one have ever seen anywhere else in the world. Lifestyle. At that Quality. affordability. Not only luxury. Because some people, they have the wrong idea about Dubai. Dubai is a luxury city, but at the same time, it's affordable. Yes. You can live in Dubai uh, with the average income that one Italian uh, normal person, you know, the, the cost of living I'll ask you is a question. not so high. Can a poor person, or not a poor, can an average earner in Italy go to a fine dining restaurant every month once and no. still afford to live? No. 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 Although I don't encourage anyone in Dubai who's on an average income to go a fine dining experience once a month, I advise him to save that money. However, he can afford in Dubai to go once a month, even on an average income. Yeah. Yeah? yeah. To a yeah. fine dining destination. Yeah. And this happens. Especially if somebody else pay. Hundred <laughs> <laughs> okay. percent. Yeah. So regardless, there is oh, this it's true. vibrancy it's true. in the in the, uh, the, the the vibes in the in the in the atmosphere, the vibes in the city are amazing. I was uh, last week with a customer, we went to a restaurant, a Lebanese restaurant on the palm. Uh, I don't want to mention the name or or I should. You can. It's up Al to you. Uh, you should mention. I it's a customer of my other Al my other company. I love so Al Safadi. This so is Al Safadi guys on the Palm. Al BBP, my other company, shoots for Al Safadi and does business with Al Safadi, and they're amazing people. I love. And we person. enter their kitchens. Yeah. So perfect. Also. Perfect. So we were me and other customers sitting there on the Palm, sea view, beautiful, beautiful environment because you are surrounded by the sea, and you have uh, you know the light. You see the Atlantis Hotel and the customers, I invited them, they had the impression to sit in a restaurant that they couldn't afford. They said, oh my God, this restaurant should be very expensive with this view, with this. And then at the end, you know how much we paid? 500 dirham. With 500 dirham, four people in Italy is very hard. How was the food? Delicious. And this is coming from an Italian, huh? It's delicious, not easy for delicious. an Italian to say delicious food. Delicious, yeah? delicious. So this is an example that in Dubai you can sit in a beautiful, beautiful place and still you don't pay an incredible amount, you know. Uh, if you want to have the same quality, the same view, sitting in front of the sea, water, the water uh, front restaurant, and you have this kind of food, you pay more. And you will not have the same vibes. Same vibes. There's something, guys, about the city. I don't know if everyone feels it, but I do. Yeah. The vibes. Yeah. It's amazing. There's very few cities, metropolitan mainly, that do have the same vibes. But the most I feel it in is Dubai.